welcome back to Tropico. Uh, it's my second time recording this episode, because the first time, just so you know, we managed to go so, so badly wrong that we lost the game. Uh, so, really don't want that to happen. Uh, I'm starting to see that we already have no money, which is bad, because that's the reason we lost the game last time. Um, so things, things are not good. Uh, let's just try and not let the financial situation spiral out of control. As you can see, we're losing all our money and it's a bit of an issue. And we're only gonna lose more money unless we do something right this instant. So, um, someone is getting their financials taken away from them. I think we better start with the plantations. They suck up lots of money. That's what we were... Press the wrong buttons, why don't you? They suck up lots of money. Also, uh, the mines, we're going to give them more money. All of them. Because the mines are useful. Uh, we're going to make sure we get more immigrants. Uh, they're useful. We don't, we don't want no immigrants. And we're going to give you less money. Much less. What else are we going to do? Um, the churches are burning, but that's a constant in this series. Did you really expect an episode of Tropico where religious institutions were not burning down? Clearly you're new here. These guard towers, we're going to give them less money because they don't do anything at all. We'll give them no money, none at all. Okay, look, look, you see, we've got actual money. This never happened. We didn't build anything for the entire of the last episode because, you know, we are in such a terrible financial state. We're going to build more parking garages because having a lack of those, it really hurts us. I, I've got this knowledge of the future, you see, and uh, it's not good. The future's not bright. All right, I have to deliver an amazing speech, which I will. Um, we're going to talk about healthcare happiness. We're going to praise the military, uh, blame the communists, and hopefully we don't lose everything. That's still the goal. Uh, my computer is very loud. You might hear it. It is currently a million degrees where I am. I think the surface of the sun is a arctic destination compared to my house. So I open the windows. You might hear the traffic. I try, I'll try and cut out the noise of the traffic is honestly a bit of a mess and I've piled a bunch of ice cubes behind my computer because that ice packs that's gonna cold right right it does it doesn't work it doesn't work it's a very stupid plan they just keep falling off the max stand it's a bit of a disaster my whole life is a bit of a disaster who would have guessed that the uh, stupidity that I used to rule my island nation would run over into my regular life as you can see nothing is getting to the thingy the storage thingy, which that is one of the things that dooms us all. Just, just so you know, just so you know, please, please, I don't want to be doomed. I really don't. One thing that did happen, not last episode, one thing that didn't happen in the episode that we're not doing. I, I'm, I'm trying to phrase these things so it makes sense. In the episode where everything fell apart, one thing that didn't happen is the power plant didn't set on fire. And that was highly unusual. I think that may have been what caused everything to fall apart. Just that deviation from the normal routine. The people, they don't take well to that. All right, I completed a task, weirdly. That's weird. I don't know how I increased my electricity rate. Maybe just by not having the power plant burn down. It is an effective strategy. You have loads of money. I'm gonna give you less money. Like, everyone gets less money. You don't know it yet. I'm not issuing the nuclear testing edict. I don't even want to know what that is. We're not doing it. This is the trade menu. This just popped up. I'm just a little bit shaken. What do you want? Do I even... I don't have any of these things to trade. I hate to break it to you. Things are not going well on my island. Uh, cars, chocolate. You think we make cars? You think we make cars? We can't do anything. One thing we can do, and must do, is build a logging camp. Because if you didn't notice, or remember, 
did last episode and what I mean the real last episode, we ran out of logging camps and I didn't remember that. And that definitely played a part in collapsing the entire economy. So um, if someone can go and build this please. Very important, very important, very important. How's the uranium mine? This, uh, he's not making a lot of uranium. Pretty disgusting if you ask me. Another thing that I realised, um, these little houses, whenever I meant, you know I mentioned that we were never ever going to upgrade from these because it'd be so expensive and we're too terrible. This house makes me, well that one makes me nothing because no one lives in it. Let's find a better example. Of course no one lives in any of my houses. Oh god, oh god, it's the actual, it's actually the rebels. Is anyone coming to deal with them? Like the army? Something, no. See, no one comes to deal with the rebels. This is odd, I don't know why. Surely someone should deal with the rebels. Look, they set fire to this one, and this church burnt to the ground. My fire department needs some serious work. But anyway, as I was saying, before I got distracted, um, these houses, yeah, this one's got residents, it makes me $28 a month. These houses make me $54 a month. That's more than double. No, no, don't read the election. We have to upgrade the houses. We already know that most of my income comes from mortgage taxes or whatever, so we got to get on that. As a nation, it's our job to jack up mortgage rates. What do you want? Hire a comage, comage educated immigrant? I'm sure that won't happen by itself. Reduce pollution. I'll do that one day. I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise a lot of things. Um, we're not doing... We're not doing well financially. I won't say that. But we haven't completely gone broke. And I think that should be... Um, cheered heroically. And I don't know what my fire department's doing. But they're doing absolutely nothing. Freedom of religion. And this. Look at, we need the unhappy citizens to leave Tropico. Get out of my island. If you don't like this island, get out. Like, this is not some kind of country where you can just sit around and oh my god oh my god we're rich well minus five thousand we're rich just shut up shut up viewers i can hear you talking to your screens shut up we don't want to we could start importing things no start exporting planks but we could start importing things right things we need things we need things we need things we need Fish farm. That is not a thing we need. Actually, that definitely is a thing we need because we've got the whole situation with the cannery. But that will come later. That will come later when we've got actual more money. We need the plastics plant, but that's a lot more money than we have. And saving. Saving is not a thing. Yeah, just just straight up. Saving. Nothing. We are in the positive. I know. It, it blew me away as well. We need this plastics plant. Plastic makes the world go round, after all. It's not It's not going to help with the pollution problem around here. But, um, shut up. To be fair, pollution is not that bad. Like, let's be real. Oh. Unless you uh, live in these shacks by the garbage dump, which is really pretty crap place to put your shack. But, um, around here, pretty good, pretty good. I'm sure the plastics plant will change that. But, shut up. The, we need the money. That, that's the long and short of it. We need it to be built as well, if you could hurry up with that. You need logs, which really, we have logs, and I don't know what this place is doing if it's not making logs. Hmm, it's not making logs. They're on the way to the tavern. That says it all. That says it all. Everyone's in the tavern. You are all working here, not that you have any fish. We'll build the fish farm one day, please shut up. Uh, and the oil. Are we making lots and lots of oil? We're making slight amounts of oil. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I like how the rebels have burnt down this church. And then just disappeared. And no one has uh, decided to do anything about them. And also, get out, Shaq. Get out. Like, it's really, it's not hard to deal with rebels. Just send someone. Someone to deal with. Anyone. Like, we have police. We have an army. We have me in my house. Surely I can go and deal with the rebels. Look, look, it's our citizenry. Oh god, what the hell are you wearing? Who are you? I'm intrigued. You work at the theatre. You're on your way to the theatre. At least someone's going to work around here. Everyone else. Pretty, pretty terrible. 
Okay, we've got the plastic plant. A view full of oil. No, good. Don't don't send any oil to here. Send the oil to here. Let's make plastics. It's very, very important to me. And the nation. Come on. They're not going to make it. I don't care. One thing we can do is um, our favourite thing. Uh, ask for financial aid. Please, we need it. We need the aid. Definitely. You could aid us by putting a new leader in charge, but I, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not a fan of that idea. We need a fire station. One round here. By the churches. Just because... Uh, Okay, it doesn't need to fit. Well, what can I say? Can I just make this fire station better? Oh, 15,000, I could have firefighting helicopter. That is what we need. A firefighting helicopter. Mm, I could save my money, but they also probably need a hospital. And many other... Th oh, we've got to get the fish farm. We need to buy blueprints. Oil rig, hang on. Hang on, oil rig. That that's infinitely more interesting than a fish farm. Where's the oil? Any in the sea? No. Oh, we've got fifteen thousand though now. So where's that um thingy? Fire station. Yep, you can have this firefighting helicopter for fifteen fifteen grand. You better fight the fires, or I'm going to kill someone. Oh my god, we're making money again. This is going so much better than last time. The cancelled episode. Okay, okay. So what are we doing? Let's buy the blueprint for the fish farm then. If things are going so well, that has even taken all our money away. Jesus, let's buy the blueprint for the hospital. We need these blueprints for future projects, you know? Oh, and can we pass any laws? Pass any laws? Can I afford to pass any laws? Oh, we also passed, so, was that? I can't remember what happened in the episode that you're not gonna see and what happened in the episode that you did see. I'm not a very good person. Employees of the mines work double shifts. Yes, yes. Everyone works double shift. That is going to help. Get get to work, please. It's not that I'm not begging. Everything's fine. Just just please. I would like it if you went to work. Look, ye mighty and despair. Nothing's burning down in my town. That reminds me, we didn't we didn't fix any of the buildings that burned down. But look at this. Come on, helicopter. Save the day. Maybe this is what we should have been doing all along. Clearly, we can't stop the rebels. We're not smart enough. But, we can stop fires. So maybe that is... We need to change tactics on this. Let the rebels rebel. They're not hurting everybody. Well, they are hurting everybody. But as long as we can help everybody at the same time. We can also do this, which kills them. So we've got it. We're going to keep killing the rebels. But we're also going to let them live. Let them be happy. Have we made any plastic at all? Yes, actually. Surprisingly. Um, oh my god, you've made loads of plastics. All in our lids, plastic by. Finally, a city with all the plastic that we deserve. I'm impressed. You never usually do anything. Citizens, this has blown me away. And we're making money. As your leader, I have never been more proud of you than I am in this moment when you're actually doing something. Right, I started importing fish. I feel like that's going to help the cannery because they're not really doing anything on their own. Do a bit, bit stupid in that department. I could build more houses, but that's not what we're going to do. You hear me? It's not what we're going to do. We could build a hospital, but we don't have any money. Uh, we're at the fish farm. No, no money for that. What about the law I want to pass? Um, no money for that either. So, uh, okay, we're going to do nothing. Oh, wait, no, we've, we've got to fix these buildings. We have got to... Okay, and the money's gone. I see your house has burnt down. When did that happen? Probably a while ago. Oh, I see the fast food joint is on fire. Send the helicopter. It's clear that you can't get there on yourselves. Like, are the roads too complicated for you? Oh, look at that. It... Look, it's done. It, it's, everything's fine. Everything's fixed. Well, it's not fixed, but it's, it's supposed to be fixed. People are going to church. They don't care that it's burnt down. They're living their best lives. Come on. Get to the dock, get to the dock, and give me loads and loads of money, and that'll be useful. Well, actually, you didn't give me loads and loads of money. That went pretty bad. Are we getting loads and loads of immigrants? No, 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 we're still good. Because when we didn't have immigrants coming, uh, we sort of ran out of workers, which was no fun. You have been burnt down. Lots of things burnt down. 
in the episode. Well, actually, no, I'm not following on from that episode. I don't know. I'm clearly I am confused by what I've done with the whole uh, cancelled episode thing. I went back. You. This is not after the. This is leading on. Look. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? What Zach's talking about? He's just babbling to himself as always. Okay, come on. The people aren't very happy with me, so we really need... Okay, we're not making a lot of money anymore. I think ordering the fish may have uh, set us over the edge when it comes to finances. Uh, what do we export? Do we have any of these things? No, I don't think we do. We have rum, but I'm pretty sure we're already exporting rum. You don't want to export something you're already exporting. What are we doing? Planks, canned goods, and fish. No, we can export rum. We can export rum. That's the one thing we can make reliably. Which, it does explain why we're also all a bit drunk. Export the rum. Do God, that's in the lava. Rebel threat. Gorillas have been defeated. They're never actually defeated, are they, though? They are just, um... Disappear. I see the fire department. Like, they don't even get there. I have to send the helicopter every time. This is what I've learned. The fire department, they can't do things on their own. Uh, you have no logs. Are you making any logs? No, you have logs. You've made the logs. Somebody deliver the logs. It's not hard. We need to empty the landfill site, but uh, we'll deal with that one day. In the future. God, 43 to 53 gorillas left. That is a lot of them. That is many, many gorillas. The finances are not, not looking good. Uh, we could do with more money, please. I, I want to take out a massive loan, but we have all learned that's a terrible, terrible plan from running a country. So I guess I'll just uh, cut the video. That is a much better idea. All right, update, news update. I am got money. I am got money. Ignore that. Ignore my poor attempt at language. What are we spending the money on that we now have? I think fish farm. I can't remember the other thing that we're going to build. It was fish farm and something else. Does anyone remember? Any hands? Anyone? Oh, it was hospital. Yeah, I care more about um, money than I do your health. That's probably not a surprise to any of you. Look, if it's there. Perfect. Have a fish farm. Uh, also, uh, what else? Oh yes, of course. Just an update of my life. Uh, I have effectively turned my desk into a massive slip and slide because there's a lot of condensation coming up all those ice blocks. So just, I want to remind anyone, anyone who's watching, maybe for the first time, uh, putting ice blocks in the space between the screen of your Mac and the stand that keeps it up is a terrible way to deal with the heat of the summer. It may be the worst way. Alright, where do I put this hospital? It's got, it's got to be on one of yours houses, because there's nowhere left on this island. I'm not putting it on the other island, you shouldn't have to go that far for medical care. Because, one, I want to charge you. Aha! Do you know what? We're crushing you, chapel. You're like in the centre of town. What do you do with your life? We already have that chapel over there. Uh, we've got all these churches for you to visit. You shouldn't be going to the little chapel anymore. I have noted that uh, we probably don't have money to build the hospital, because the amount of money we have has gone down sharply since I started talking. Which, bit of a sad mood, if you ask me. No, we can't afford it. Well, you know what? I'm not ending the episode until we uh, get the money for the hospital. So how about that? Okay, we've now got loads of loads of less money. Okay, things. I shouldn't have said that. You're burning. Send the helicopter. We've learnt, we've learnt not to trust the ground fire department. They're losers. You have no iron. Where's the iron mine? Why are they not doing their jobs? Okay, I gave them all the money. Just no one's inside dock. And just what are you doing there? No, genuinely, what are you doing there? Are you in the car that has crashed? No, that is someone else. Inside dock. I don't know what they're doing at the dock. Having some kind of party with alcohol and drugs, I imagine. They're not... They're not the brightest bulbs in the box, are they? Okay. Rebel threat's going down, but it's always going down to medium and up to high. That's its whole thing. Uh, employee of the month has reached level one. We've got sent money, not enough to build a hospital, but the boat's about to arrive, and yes, now we have cash. 
we are going to build a wonderful hospital where you can all get medical care as long as you don't cut the power. That should be the uh, slogan for the hospital. Please don't cut the power, otherwise you will die. And um, that can go like that. What else? What else? We've got like a little bit of money left. We can have another logging camp. I don't see. You know what? We're just gonna save our money. We're gonna practice financial prudence. I know I said earlier in the episode that saving was stupid and useless, but don't listen to me. Never listen to me. As someone whose desk is covered in ice water, I can tell you I am not a smart man.